Hello, everybody, and happy Super Tuesday. This is the third Tuesday of the year. And can you believe it? Like half of the month, half of January is already gone. So today I have received a request, and the request was for uh, featuring two bedroom condos in downtown Toronto. In, an, in a district called C01, and I will show you that on the map for those that are not familiar with it. And what I'll do is I'll compare the past three months of uh, this year or the end of 2022 with the previous year, and we will see how the numbers look. Uh, so hang on with me one quick second, and I will show you that on the screen. So here we go. This is C01, District C01. Uh, you can see all the way downtown. It will include uh, Liberty Village. It will include uh, King West, Queen West, the Fashion District, and some of the Financial District as well. Uh, this area is very popular. And, you know, those condos are usually selling fairly quickly and for good prices. What we're going to look at are two bedroom condos, um, 800 square feet to 1,000. Um, they're going to have a minimum of two washrooms and a balcony or a terrace for that, for that matter. Uh, I'm going to look at the ones that sold in the past three months. Bear with me a second. So you can see here, uh, the sold date is October of 2022, and it goes all the way to January 6, 2023, this year. 47 sales. I'm going to look closely into the statistics. And you can see that the sold price, the average sold price, was 944000 The second uh, factor or number to look at is the difference between the sale price and the asking price. And currently, it is 98%. It's not bad, but last year it was better, and you'll see that uh, shortly. Days on market, 29 days on the market. That's what it took to sell those condos um, you know, in the past three months. So I'm going to go to uh, a year ago. And you can see here that the sold date starts in October 17, 2021, goes all the way to uh, January 16, 2022. And you can see that we've had many more sales, 119 sales in that same period of time. It is more than double. If I look at the statistics, I'm looking at 951,000 as the average sold price. Now, that is only $7,000 difference between this year. So we did not have a huge decline like everybody you know, is thinking. Uh, this segment is doing very, very well. Uh, look at the difference between the sale price to the asking price from a year ago. It's 102% of asking. Last year, almost every unit sold over the asking price with multiple offers. The days on market is uh, 21 days, which is a bit faster than last year. But again, within, I would say within normal. Having said all of that, um, I can tell you that coming in the next uh, week or so, we will see uh, probably another increase by the Bank of Canada uh, to the interest rates. Uh, we're going to go up by 25 basis points. And hopefully, you know, that is not going to shake our market as much or, you know, you know it's going to give it a bit more uh, of a uh, certainty. And, and that's what buyers and sellers are, are looking for going forward. We are trying to um, figure out where we're going with that. Um, and this way we will know if there's going to be any more uh, downside to prices. And hopefully the market will start moving again. So until then and until my next report, um, have a great day and we'll see you or talk to you soon. Bye-bye.